Hi, I'm Wendy Hughes John with GreenspacesRealEstate.com and Westside Green Living with Wendy on Facebook. And I'm going to talk a little bit today about food composting at home. And a lot of people don't realize that there's a way to do it without having fruit flies all over your house. Most people, they get those cute little countertop containers or little ceramic things. And they put the little bags in it. I know I did this over 10 years ago. I've been through this whole saga already of then ending up with all these little flies everywhere. And the cats have a good time with it, but the people don't necessarily. So what you can do is actually store your compostable uh, clippings in the freezer in a half gallon milk carton. And um, what we do, and, the, and these are and these are full already, is you just take a used milk carton um, and tear the top open and you just stuff all of your um, scraps in here. And then at the end of the week when you go to put all your stuff into the um, bin, because we have um, curbside compost pickup here in Seattle, you just squeeze it all out and you can put it into a compostable bag or straight into your bin. And this will actually still be probably be mostly frozen when they go to pick it up, so you won't even have bugs in your outside bin. Now today was the opening of the High Point Market Garden here in my neighborhood and the Seattle uh, City of Seattle helps manage that garden there. They brought some um, goodie bags that they had left over from Greenfest, which was uh, about a month ago. And they were just for handing out the screw, uh, the little curly Q light bulb stuff, but they also uh, gave us these compost bins. Most people, they will put this under their sink, which is actually the hottest spot in your kitchen because of the dishwasher running hot water. Or leave it on the counter. I don't think this is really pretty enough to leave on the counter. But it fit right on the freezer shelf, so this is awesome. So we're not going to change anything. We still don't have any bugs. And you can get these little compostable bags that you can put into the compost bin. We've already put some stuff in here. And you just, you just line this with your bag. When it's full, you just take the bag out. You put this bag inside your curbside um, container. And you, it'll, everything will be mostly clean. And you can just wash this out occasionally, but most of the time this will stay clean because it's all in the freezer and everything will clean out really easily. So um, if you look for a compost container and you want to do it the freezer method, um, get something that can um, handle the cold temperatures. So I think that's it for today. Thanks for watching. My name is Wendy Hughes John. If you have any questions, you can contact me at wendyhj at greenspacesrealestate.com. Thanks for watching and have a good day.